Coming up next, a UFC welterweight division matchup. All right, talented fighter making the walk here tonight. I will be surprised, Joe, if we see him put on his back at any point tonight. Incredible takedown defense, great balance, very solid base, an outstanding sprawl that's very quick and athletic. And for a lot of fighters, they waste a lot of energy trying to bring this man down. Got to think the smart approach will be to see if you can get the shot early, but if it doesn't materialize, go to plan B. This guy's takedown defense north of 90%. Some of the best takedown artists in the world have failed to take him down. So here he is, the founder of Jeet Kune Do, and the man Dana White calls the father of modern mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is making the walk tonight. This is perhaps the most influential martial artist of all time. Great combination of speed and power, and the power is really set up by his precision, his dynamic striking style, his timing. Bruce Lee was quoted as saying, the best fighter is someone who can adapt to any style. No one has been more adaptable than this man, Lee. I'm a Bruce. This guy has extremely unusual kicking speed. His technique is outstanding, and there is no wind-up to his movement. Our tale of the tape for this welterweight fight. Four years, the difference in age between these two fighters, with big differences in height, but some differences in reach. Let's get it started. Here's Bruce Buffett. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Dan Mergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out Toyota Center in Houston, Texas. And This man is a Muay Thai kickboxer and jiu-jitsu fighter, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet three inches tall, weighing in at 170 pounds. Bam Bam! And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 185 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon Lee! All right, grip the rules in the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. I want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, come out your corners, come out fighting. I am very fired up for this fight. It's been a long time coming. The fans have been anticipating this for a long time, and it is going to go down right now. And we are ready to go with live action from Toyota Center here in Houston, Texas. All right, here is Bruce Lee getting ready for another UFC start as we begin round one. So fast, so quick, so good at setting up striking angles, and it's hard to simulate the speed in training. I know the opponent has talked a lot about trying to find training partners to simulate Bruce Lee. Easier said than done. Bruce Lee trying to get off to a good start tonight. Oh, trying to turn out the lights with that roundhouse kick, but just misses. Hook to the head, lands flush there by Lee. Looking for the left hook. Right hook to the head, blocked. Lands a strike there. That one hurt. He's going after the head. That strike will count. Well, he left his head open there, Joe, and he got cracked with that jab. He was almost moving into it, so let's see if he can switch up the footwork here, Joe, and make the requisite adjustments. 
splits the guard and connects with the punch. Nice body kick. He landed a left hand there. Oh, flying knee! Vicious combinations. Hard left hand. Big shot. Whoa! He's trying to hang on. Uppercut attempt does not get to the target. Nice job defensively there by Lee. Good shot. And avoids the clinch. Hit him hard with that hook. that hook, Joe. A powerful right hand. Under three minutes now to go in what has been a very fast-paced opening round here. Tying up here in the clinch. And from here, transitions to the Muay Thai clinch. Oh, elbow to the head in the clinch. That one landed flush by Lee. Oh, he hit him with a big knee. Now he's got the Muay Thai plum. Big knee, knee lands knee. there. Oh, man. That'll make you forget your childhood. And he's in the Muay Thai clinch. Oh, head kick. Good uppercut attempt. Visibly limping here. So three minutes have flown off the fight clock there. Well, some have gotten through, Joe. This shot is blocked. Under two minutes in the first round. And both guys really throwing with authority. How about that chin? I like the way you mix that up here. Lands a powerful kick. Throwing hard in the pocket. Powerful jab. Body kick like that. Well, he's playing with fire here, Joe. He continues to be vulnerable to that jab by almost leaning into it right into his opponent's range. Gotta find a way to move those feet and ultimately get that head off of the center line. Hard hook. And he's looking for that left. Now he goes for the single leg. Joe judges had oh. like that on the cut. Oh! He's trying to stay up. Misses a huge hook to the head. 45 seconds to go here in round one. Whoa! Oh. Man has his chin in the Really threw everything into that uppercut, but fell short. Oh, a lot of blood coming out of that cheek area now, Joe. This could be it right here. And there he swung with the haymaker. Oh, he might be out. Nasty combinations here. Ten seconds now to go in the round. Slips to a He's hurt again. Boom sounds for the end of round one. Oh, what a way to end the round. He got stunned by a huge shot there just before you heard the horn. So he gets saved by the bell. The question is, though, what type of condition will he be in when he gets up off that stool? 60 seconds here to recover. The onus is on his corner to keep his head in the fight. And here is one more massive punch he lands that really stuns. Several near fight ending moments in that round. Lots of action. Listen, all right. Hey, we all take shots, okay? All right, listen. Come Brittany Palmer doing her thing as usual.
here comes the kick. That one blocked by Lee. Pretty evenly matched in terms of the significant strikes thrown and landed. Lee gets caught with that punch. He's doing a great job of blocking things here. Slips the punch. Missed the mark. Oh, he lands another strike to the body here. He's really starting to connect Joe on a lot of these strikes to the midsection. That one hurt. Oh! This could be it! Oh! Huge shot there, Lance Flush! Closing the distance here. And he pummels out of it. That cut on his eyebrow is getting worse. Oh, beautiful trip. And now he moves to his back. Excellent sweep, winds up in guard. Beautiful reversal. Well, you gotta stay busy on the bottom. He's doing it here. Nice punch. And now he's working from full mount. Oh, he connects there. Still holding the back. Just over three minutes to go in round two. Beautiful sweep. Side control. Trying to pass here. Lee's worked in that underhook now. The battle for hooks continues. He's got double underhooks now. Well, his corner was pretty urgent after round one. A little bit lackluster there in that opening round. He has certainly picked up the pace here, and as a result, he has taken control of this second round. Lee gets touched by that kick to the body. How about that chin? He's fainting with that punch, showing that punch. Oh, he blocked that offense, Joe. Well, yet again, he goes back to the jab, and he lands it. And defensively, this fighter is going to have to figure something out. He continues to lean into his opponent's striking range. He's going to have to stick and move and figure out a way to get his head off the center line. There's a nice left hand. Big shots being landed on both sides here. Oh, beautiful kick there. Big body Big shot. body. Ninety seconds now remain in the round. Hard straight punch. He's doing a good job of throwing punches and kicks from all angles here. Really doing a great job of mixing things up. Huge uppercut misses. Went high, missed. Lee gets caught with that punch. He's treading water now. Gotta find a way to move those feet. Good defense there. He clipped him with an uppercut. Oh, and he connects with a punch yet again. He has attacked that area nonstop. Probably targeting the cut, I would think, at this point in time. Faint in. He lands a nice kick. He's got good accuracy on that jab. Tried to set up the straight left, but he missed. Oh, you gotta like the output here. So aggressive with the strikes, he continues to light him up. Gotta be careful here not to gas out, of course, but you gotta like the offense we're seeing from him, especially in this round. That cut on his cheek. Oh, he's out. He's out. That's it! That's it! Unbelievable! And here's the end. Check it out again. Look at this. 
crank right on the jaw. Well, hard to perform much better than he did tonight. A huge knockout under the lights. They'll be talking about that one for some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mugliano is going to stop for this contest at 4 minutes, 43 seconds of round number 2. Declaring the winner by knockout, Bruce the Dragon Lee. Well, what else can you say about Bruce Lee after a performance like this one? Seemingly everyone on the roster wants to take their cracks against one of the founding fathers of mixed martial arts. And candidly, thus far, few men have succeeded. This just might have been Bruce Lee's best performance inside the octagon.